everybody, it's Honest John again. Now, in 2018, there is the possibility that there will be a wave election in favor of the Democrats. They have a, chance, a, a very good chance to take the House. And a, an uphill battle, but a chance to take the Senate. The Republicans are cratering. Their tax cuts, which are, were extremely unpopular, I mean, who wants to give more money to the rich? Why do we need to blow up the deficit so that the rich can get richer? And Donald Trump's racism, sexism, ignorance and stupidity and utterly repulsive behavior and personality have created the possibility that the Democrats could win big in 2018. And that would cripple the Trump presidency. It would create investigations that would actually try to find out what did Trump did wrong and prevent him from putting, if, if the Democrats got the Senate, prevent any, him from putting any more judges on the courts. But now I hear that Chelsea Manning is running for the Senate in Maryland. And I heard Cenk Wigger call her a hero. Now this is how the Democrats could blow it. If someone like Chelsea Manning is successful in the primary, then that solid blue seat will be in the hands of the Republicans for the next six years. Chelsea Manning is not a hero. Chelsea Manning didn't see something wrong and call attention to it. What Chelsea Manning did was leak thousands of pages of sensitive diplomatic documents indiscriminately. Probably didn't even know what was in, in them because she didn't read them. This isn't heroism. It's treason. Now I'm sure a Manning candidacy would make the extreme left cream in their genes. And I'm sure that there will be other candidates from the fringes like Manning who will enter the race before it's all said and done. And they must be beaten back mercilessly and convincingly. The last thing the Democrats need is to be associated with treason. Leave treason to the GOP. They're good at it. But that's the danger of the extreme left. Not their goals, not their ideals, not what they would like to do. But that it, they will stupidly allow this country to be dominated by the extreme right. Thanks for listening.